Why Princess Diana's engagement ring caused upset with the royal's Princess Diana's engagement ring, which featured a 12-carat oval salon sapphire, was not popular among the royals after Prince Charles asked for her hand in marriage, despite now becoming one of the most famous pieces of jewelry in history. As reported in Vogue, despite the ring boasting a white gold band and 14 solitaire diamonds, the crown jeweler Garrett featured the piece in its catalogue which meant that anyone could have bought the £47,000 ring and in turn, was a problem with the royal family. Gerard was inspired by the sapphire and diamond cluster brooch that was made for Prince Albert in 1840, which he went on to gift Queen Victoria as a wedding present and she wore it as her something blue. Since then, the Queen has worn the very same brooch at a number of public events. It was also reported that Diana picked out the jewel herself, while others claim that she chose it because it was the biggest and reminded her of her mother's engagement ring. Princess Diana loved her engagement ring so much that she continued to wear it after her divorce from Prince Charles in 1996 and it was made into a bracelet. She then started wearing an emerald-cut aquamarine ring in its place, the same one that Meghan Markle wore with her second wedding dress. Grant Mobley a gemologist and director at Plutchznik and one of the world's leading diameters, said, A beautiful ring that Princess Diana was seen wearing on her ring finger after her divorce from Prince Charles was an emerald cut, aquamarine and diamond ring. He continued, The princess was very fond of a pearl and diamond bracelet featuring a large emerald cut aquamarine that she was given in her early years as a princess and, after her divorce, she commissioned this matching ring to be made. Diana's taste in jewelry was impeccable and the fact that she commissioned this ring to be made is a clear testament to her taste. She always chose diamond jewelry that was meaningful to her, she was very intentional with her jewelry choices and made sure they were the best representation of those meaningful moments, he said, as reported in the Express. The aquamarine ring is thought to be around £75,000 because of the size color and quality of the center diamond and a diamond from one of her rings was also used to make Meghan Markle's engagement ring. Despite including a stone from Botswana and two diamonds from Princess Diana's personal collection, Meghan Markle's engagement ring was compared to one available from Argos for just £33. The ring was made by Cleveland Company, court jewelers and medalists for Her Majesty. Sarah Philip Pardos had jewelry buyer at Argos, told the son, Prince Harry's choice of a diamond trilogy ring for Meghan is beautiful. For anyone inspired by Harry's act of romance who isn't able to pop to Botswana for a diamond, Argos has a fantastic range of similar trilogy engagement rings with prices starting from as little as £32.99. However, the diamondstore.co.uk estimated that it cost £199,475 and the stone is likely to be a D in color, the clearest. Meghan also paid tribute to her late mother-in-law on her wedding day and wore Diana's engagement ring to her wedding reception. When Diana passed away in 1997, Prince William and Prince Harry inherited her jewelry collection, which included her engagement ring, according to Good Housekeeping. The late princess wrote, I would like you to allocate all my jewelry to the share to be held by my sons, so that their wives may, in due course, have it or use it. I leave the exact division of the jewelry to your discretion. There are rumors that while Harry originally picked out the iconic sapphire gem, after he saw William's love for Kate Middleton, the prince exchanged the engagement ring for his mother's Cartier watch, so that the Duke of Cambridge could propose to this duchess. Prince William reportedly had the ring with him for three weeks while they were on holiday in Mount Kenya in 2010 and when he announced the engagement, he said, It's my mother's engagement ring, and it's very special to me, as Kate is very special to me now as well. It was only right that two were put together. It was my way of making sure mother didn't miss out on today in the excitement, the Duke said, as reported in Marie Claire. After making a few alterations, Kate's ring became one of the world's most famous rings, now worth over $500,000, £393,000. Princess Diana may have started a trend as now that replica engagement rings have been made available on the high street, 
shoppers have flocked to buy pieces similar to that of Meghan Markle's or Princess Eugenie's pink sapphire ring. Jewel.com, that specializes in royal replicas, revealed that Meghan's yellow gold ring is now the top seller while sales of other Hollywood styles have decreased by 50%. Kate and Pippa Middleton's rings were also popular on the website.